Don't forget the doc. Several network participants recently called into Dr. Rick Wright's Old School Sunday's radio show. Check this out. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here's a guy who has no controversy. All he presents every Sunday at 3.30 from the Berkeley School of Music in Boston, Massachusetts. Great information about the music industry. Because every time the music gets played, somebody, somebody gets, paid. gets paid. Oh, wow. Yes. I love that, John. How you doing, John Kellogg? I'm doing well. How you doing, Doc? Oh, man, we happening, man. In the summer of 2010, August, weather's still hanging in, man. And by the way, this morning when I was headed out to church, went to church at St. James Episcopal Church out in Skinny Atlas, New York, and the Lost Boys of Sedan. And all wow. their families were guests this morning, so I want to check them. They had a waterside, waterside, Skinny Atlas Lake, lakeside service. And I met a couple from Skinny Atlas who were looking inside the church, and they never seen it before. <laughs> and they live in Boston, Massachusetts. And I mentioned oh, you, man, and the Berkeley School of Music. So, John, that's another story, man. So, All right. Tell us about the music industry, man. I want to get rich, man. I'll listen to you. How you doing, Doc? <laughs> and to, uh, hello to you and to the 106.9 family. Here's your business report for this week. A report on the business behind the music because everybody knows somebody in the music business. Those of you watching Keith Sweat's Platinum House series on Drew Hill have witnessed by now the craziness that is the world of group members Jazz, Cisco, Nokio, and Tao. You've seen boxing matches and psychotherapy sessions with the group, all in an effort to help them achieve some cohesiveness as they embark on promoting their new album, Andrew Pendant's Day, that was released last week on Kadar Massenberg's label, Kadar Entertainment. As I mentioned before on The Biz, the Kadar label is home for many vintage R&B artist albums of late, including Keith Sweat, Joe, Genuine, and Chico DeBarge. Kadar Massenberg is the former president of Motown Records and is doing a great service to fans of R&B by giving a vehicle for these artists to gain more exposure. Also, look for a greatest hits album by my man, the late Gerald LaVert, later this month. He has a new single out called Can It Stay. Doc, you guys playing Can It Stay? Oh, yeah. I think we on it, man. Hey, Kenny D's, are we on it, man? <laughs> I had to check with my program director here, man. Hope he's listening. If not, it will be here at Power yeah, 106. Know, Ken, Kenny's right on it, so I'm sure he's playing it. And that, that song is barreling up the charts to number one. And I just finished working out a deal for his dad, Eddie LaVert, to promote the album on radio and TV programs. Now, this album contains two father and son hits, and that's the reason why Eddie will be promoting it. You remember the song, Baby, Hold On To Me and Already Missing You. Both of those songs are going to be on this album, as well as about 13 other, other tracks, the greatest hits of Gerald's career, and it's due to be released on August 31st, so be sure to pick it up. And lastly, on a sad note, as you've probably all heard by now, the founder and driving force behind the group, The Moments, has passed, the, passed away last week, and I saw this on uh, Kitty D's blog. Al Goodman, bass and baritone singer with the group, and Ray Goodman and Brown died at the age of 67 as a result of a heart ailment. Now our prayers are with his loved ones that include the vast family of fans who for years listened to and loved Love on the Two-Way Street, Special Lady, and all of the other great tracks blessed by his voice. And that's it for this week. Remember, every time the music gets played, somebody gets paid. And if you're an artist, songwriter, or producer, always take care of business and get paid, not played. Talk well, to you in a couple of weeks, Doc. Well, John Kellogg from the Berkeley School of Music, the world's greatest musical genius and attorney. We love you, and thanks for being our in-resident musical expert. Okay, John, take care in Boston, Massachusetts. Oh, man, John Kellogg. All right, so get to all the Syracuse University alums throughout the world. Checking out Dr. Rick Wright, Power 106.9, Old School Sunday. On a big bad Sunday afternoon, Dr. Rick Wright live and well in Syracuse here at Power 106.9 Radio. Do it. The network reminds you that you too may call in to Dr. Rick Wright on Sundays between 1 p.m. and 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Check in with the doc at area code 315 
Don't forget the dot.